How's it going everybody? Welcome to We Do Tech. So today we're going to take a look at the T4's Z340 Cardi PCI Express 3 NVMe SSD. Now this isn't the newest SSD on the market, but for the price point and what it delivers is actually a pretty good deal. So currently you do have two options available. So then the Z340 is again the PCI Express 3 version, but you also get the Z440, which is the PCI PCI Express 4 version, but that one's also quite a bit more expensive at around $55 more for the one terabyte of model uh, like we have here. And currently, and we, unfortunately, we don't have one, so we couldn't compare it to the Z340. Now then, as for pricing for the Z340, it is a very well priced if you can actually uh, find one. We were only able to find the one terabyte model in the US, which was retailing for around $120. However, here in South Africa, we are quite a bit more lucky because we had one more option. So the 512 gig version is going for around 1,800 rand and then a 2,400 rand for the one terabyte model. So quite a lot more options available here for us. Stay tuned till the end of the video to find out why Surfshark is one of the best value for money VPNs and how you can save 83% on a two year plan plus three months absolutely free. Also with a 30 day money back guarantee so stay tuned for that but also link in the video description specs wise the z340 uses a 64 layer 3d tlc nand flash with a lifespan of 1665 tbw total bytes are written for the one terabyte model that we have here and then also you get a five year warranty as well now the design of the z340 is nothing special it does have a blue pcb with what i thought at first to be just a normal a black and a copper sticker on it but it ended up being a graphene and copper heat spreader that's less than one millimeter thick but now how good can a heat spreader be that's less than one millimeter thick well actually it was kind of pretty good so after about 20 minutes of intense stress testing the maximum temp to reach was a 71 degrees celsius which isn't that great really but given that the small size of the heat spreader and we did didn't add anything extra on top of that it actually did decently well the Sabrin rocket which did have an enormous heat spreader on as well did see a max of 71 degrees celsius and that is the thermal throttle a point for most ssds now again it did reach that 70 degrees but it didn't thermal throttle that much it did lower it somewhat but we didn't see anything too drastic and also with our stresses we do take it quite over the top with an unrealistic stress test so uh, most of the cases you won't really even be able to notice that and then also if your motherboard does have a heat spray for your m.2s you can just pop that on and that will also help out quite a bit now then getting into the benchmarks i am going to compare the z340 to a couple of other ssds that we have a benchmark before also currently we only have the one terabyte a model here and the speeds do differ between the capacities with the larger ones are being fastest most of the time so just keep that in mind so then the performance from the z340 was actually quite decent to our surprise as we could see with sequential tests that it reached the 3400 megabytes a second read speeds and a little bit over the write speeds of a 3070 megabytes a second actually coming in a very close to the fastest piece of experts a 3 ssd that we have tested thus far now as for random reads and writes the z340 was extremely impressive with one of our tests actually beating out the PCI Express 4 SSDs with the fastest by about 18%. Even on the second random test, it was a very close to them, only lacking behind a mere 7%. Now, we also did some copy and paste tests to see how the Z340 handles our file transfers. So, the first test that we did was with a 38 gig Steam backup, which we copied to 
from and then also made a duplicate on the same drive. For the test that we copied to the Z340, it only took 28 seconds. Copying from it back to another drive only took 25 seconds and the duplicate on the same drive only took 53 seconds. Now we also did the same test but now with a larger file 113 gigs. The test where we copied it to the Z340 took 151 seconds, copying from the Z340 again it took 94 seconds and the duplicate took 254 seconds which placed it right below our PCI Express of 4 SSDs so a very good performing SSD indeed. Now we did see with the copy test that the speed did fluctuate quite a bit dropping down to around 150 megabytes a second and then bouncing back to 500 megabytes a second uh, nothing really plateauing just dropping down and going straight so not bad so then in the end the z340 is a very good ssd and it should definitely be considered when looking for a new one especially at these speeds yes there are cheaper ones on the market but with a significant decrease in speed like the wd blues which is about 105 dollars but the read speeds are dropped to only 2400 megabytes a second that's a 42 percent decrease in performance for only $15 less. Honestly, not worth it in my opinion. So the Z340 is a very good value for money SSD. And again, they do even have the PCI Express 4 version that's also available, which does have a 5,000 megabytes a second reads and 4,400 second megabytes of writes, which is really good. The one terabyte version of that does go for $175. So it is quite a bit more at $55 or more, but you pay for what you get so they're quite a bit faster so if you're currently still rocking a pizza express 3 motherboard then this could be a good option if you're going for pizza express 4 then maybe the z440 would be a better option but either way the z340 is a very good option to go for Looking for a VPN but want to pay less and get even more features? Well, Surfshark is the VPN to get. I've been using them for more than a year now and I'm definitely not disappointed. Surfshark has over 3,200 servers with a limited speed drops unlike some others. Get all of the standard advantages of a VPN like no geo restrictions to access US and Netflix from different countries, no government restrictions on news and get a better prices on flights, games and a software. Not only that, but Surfshark features industry-leading encryption, multi-hopping for a next-level privacy, a kill switch to prevent any personal information from being leaked, and one of my favorite features, unlimited devices. So you can use Surfshark for the entire family on everybody's device without needing to pay for an extra account. So follow my link below to save 83% on a two-year plan with an extra three months absolutely free. Try it out and if you don't like it, you do have a 30 day money back guarantee absolutely free. But now that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this review, please like, share, recommend, comment, like always. Also, if you want to get the Z340 for yourself, we'll leave links in the video description. Big thanks to Big C South Africa for sending these ones over for review. Uh, and yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll check all of you next time. Cheers, guys.